Regarding what approach is best suited um, to, to deal with a, a particular problem, um, it, it occurs to me that, that, that this is how governments um, uh, pursue uh, uh, finding solutions. Uh, and and uh, the challenge is to, to balance competing uh, interests um, to ensure things like operational effectiveness uh, or, or allow for that to happen uh, and, and to have as a result the best decision possible. And so this is really um, how governments, I, I think, try to tackle uh, the problem of, of choosing a particular model um, or approach. The question around multi-stakeholderism uh, is really a good one because uh, there, there's, there has to be a limit to how far you can stretch the meaning of multi-stakeholderism in different organizations um, without rendering the, the word as, as having little uh, value. Uh, so uh, what, what are those features that, um, that, 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 that are, are really um, at, at the core of this concept of multi-stakeholderism? Um, at the beginning of, of the discussion, um, I heard a greater emphasis on, on two divides, uh, two tracks. So whether that's uh, different organizations, whether it's different parts within a single government, uh, or, or two uh, uh, philosophical uh, uh, approaches to, to looking at things. But I think where we're coming to is a recognition that uh, while the, the, there may be a, a duality, that these dualities do not exist in complete isolation. I think I'm also hearing that um, we think that uh, the, the internet governance perspective uh, based on the multi-stakeholder principle is more likely or more likely to need to influence um, other approaches rather than the opposite of that. Um, and, and the risks are that, um, that, that we're, we're mistaken, in fact. But, um, but, but when all said and done, um, governments are equally committed to uh, uh, various models. Uh, for example, uh, they may be equally committed to ICANN and the ITU, for example. And so we need to, to, to think about that and, and really um, how that plays out uh, in the future. But with this uh, evolution, this ongoing evolution, uh, and the successes we've talked about, like increasing participation uh, from uh, uh, various parts of the world, uh, an increase in terms of number, uh, interest, capacity, uh, to participate, we've, we've created some new challenges for our, ourselves, um, but, but that's okay because, uh, in fact, we can uh, uh, find ways to, to uh, organize regionally uh, or locally. Uh, I think uh, many of us uh, have talked about the successes of the regional uh, internet governance forums. Well, why do they resonate? Uh, so so well um, because people think that they have a greater influence or a stronger voice um, by being active locally and also being able to impact things at a global level. Uh, when all said and done, uh, I think it's useful for us to keep internet users at the center of, of all we do. So thank you.